Yo, what's up? Tony from HowToBuyAndSellYourCars.com. Hope all is well today. I hope you could hear me pretty good. I'm in a 97 Mazda Miata. I haven't sold it because I actually like driving it. Um, anyway, let me button down the hatch. All right, so I get a lot of questions still till this day about people saying, hey, Tony, do I need a dealer's license to buy and sell cars for profit? Or my state only allows me to sell five to six cars or seven cars a year uh, when I'm buying and selling cars for profit. Or my state only allows me to sell three cars per year. You, you know, and everybody gets hung up. I mean, what's the big deal? You know, why don't you just go out and find a deal? Like find one car because that's gonna take a little bit of time to, to actually know what you're looking for. Go find the deal and then spruce it up, do what you gotta do, get it nice and cleaned up and sell it for profit. Then sell one, then get one done. At least put a couple thousand dollars in your pocket before you start to complain, before you start to worry about things that you don't even have to worry about. I don't understand that, you know? You know, there are some of the people out there who are like, yeah, Tony, I, I took your course and it was amazing. I did 10 cars my first six months after, you know, investing in your program. But there are uh, the majority of people get hung up and they don't know if this business is for them. They don't know if they should get started. And that's that's the dangerous wheel, you know, the, the wheel of uncertainty. And you're just on the Ferris wheel thinking and thinking and thinking and nothing gets done. That's that's what hurts you even more than actually taking action and buying cars and, and getting busted. I mean, what are they gonna do? What are they gonna do? Worst case scenario, slap you on the wrist and say, hey, you can't you know, buy and sell cars anymore. You can't, you know. I mean, what's the big deal? There's no law saying how many cars you can own. Look at Jay Leno. He has a car collection of over 250 cars and he sells a lot of them every once in a while. He trades them up. Sometimes he'll get rid of one, and sometimes he'll add more to his collection. So stop letting that fear of failure or uncertainty stop you. Go out and just figure, all right, I'm gonna do one, because Tony said, get off my ass, find one deal and profit, and then see how you feel, and then, get used to it you get your feet wet and then do the legal limit at least at least you'll have an extra 20 grand in your pocket every year if you do the legal limit at least anyway write your comments below thanks for watching this video please like like it share it comment and um also i want to make an, an uh some uh, more videos based on what your questions are and please don't have these same questions or with the title and I mean this is all little stuff that's not a big deal everybody's getting making big deals out of things that shouldn't be a big deal so what is the number one thing holding you back besides from ah oh, the legal limit or ah oh, do I need a dealer's license what's stopping you because I think it's something more greater than that let me know in the comments below I'll talk to you soon have a great day cheers bye Thank you.